Welcome to Intaver Institute videos on Introduction to Project Risk Analysis, Part 7, Integrated Costs and Schedule Risk Analysis. Uh, in this video, what we're going to do is look at one of the uh, more common issues that we see uh, in the Project Risk Analysis, and that is that the cost and schedule estimates, the assumptions behind them, are not aligned. And in that case, many times uh, the cost estimates are not taking into account uh, the effect of schedule risk. Uh, what we've seen in uh, the research that's coming out, uh, particularly from David Hewlett uh, from projectrisk.com, if you look at his, at his site, what he shows is that between 40 to 70 percent of project risk is, is time dependent, it's being based on schedule drift. So what we'll do is we'll take a look at uh, how we model that in Risky Project. So what we're looking at here is a very simple oil and gas example. We have a schedule and you can see that we do have some uncertainty associated with that. Well, that's the uncertainty about just being able to execute the schedule. We have resources. Now resources have been assigned to particular activities and you can see that they have rates and they have units. So all of them are signed at 100%. The project management, uh, obviously not at a full um, percentage, it's at 25%. And so we're going to be modeling uh, the effect of schedules and resources that are signed and the costs that are associated with it with the schedule and cost risks that we've associated with it. Now, <clears throat> we've also got some costs in the system. Uh, they have, uh, some of them have some uncertainty associated with them, some of them don't. As you can see, so these ones do, uh, don't have any uncertainty and these do. There's a little bit. And the other thing that we do have is we have the risk register. And uh, as you've been seeing in the previous videos, we're so we've been able to assign these risks. <coughs> we've been able to assign these risks to the project cost or schedule. Now we can run we're going to run a, a simulation. Obviously uh, we can see which are our most critical risks. But what we really want to take a look at is in the analysis. And when we go to the result Gantt We can see the uh, effect that these risks and uncertainties are having on the schedule, particularly if we're looking at cost. Our original base estimate is around $15 million. We can see we almost have no chance of meeting that uh, whatsoever if we drag this across. And what we've done by uh, what I wanted to show briefly on this is by being able to put in <coughs> costs and uh, uh, schedule loaded with resources, with rates, and uh, activities with some costs. We're able to get actually a fuller picture. Now one of the things that we'll lo be looking at in uh, some future videos about how we can separate the impacts out of those costs and schedule risk. Uh, for further analysis, but what are the what we can do, and what the what with the newer software out, and with the hardware, uh, the performance is uh, strong enough that we can bring in uh, a fairly large schedules with, that are resource loaded and cost loaded, and run a full schedule risk analysis on it, in which both the schedule and cost estimates, the assumptions behind them, are fully aligned. So we're going to get a much more accurate estimate. Thanks.